I'm not sure where to start, but I do, I do have to tell you that uh, we decided to do something that I had mentioned earlier, bringing opera theater to the public. Yes, I love that idea. And so we are performing Amal and the Night Visitors, a wonderful uh, inspirational opera by Giancarlo Menotti. It was the first television opera performed in 1951 on TV for the first time with uh -huh. NBC. Uh -huh. It was also, it founded the Hallmark Hall of Fame. There was wow. that, that performance. And once that was performed, it won the hearts of Americans all over the country. And why was and that? The storyline? Well, or? the story is a, about um, a young uh, boy who is crippled, mm -hmm. and uh, they're very poor. It's he and his mother uh, uh, live in this kind of a, a very dilapidated home. And uh, he is, uh, Amal, the, the young boy, is he usually tells tall tales. And it's because his imagination is wandering. Mm -hmm. And all he can do is he, you know, he limps around on a crutch. He, right. he can't walk very well. And so he's always dreaming of things, and he's always dreaming about the stars and playing his little flute, and he's doing little things that kids do. Right. And one day there's a knock at the door, and he answers the door, and there is a king at the door. Mm -hmm. Now the story revolves around the visit of the three magi, and they are on their way uh, to visit the Christ child. And when the mother realizes uh, that uh, they have treasures with them mm -hmm. and gold oh. and all sorts of interesting things. Uh, they ask if they can stay there for the night because they're tired. And so um, what they decide to do is to introduce themselves and they ask what Amal does and he used to be a shepherd and all that and they become acquainted. But, uh, and they decide to, to invite some of the community, uh -huh. the other <laughs> shepherds in the area, and uh, there's a beautiful dance in the middle, so this sort of entertainment in the middle. But when everybody goes to sleep, the mother is enticed by the gold. The gold. And she tries to take a steal it. it. Now, there's a page that brought the three magi that sort of is in charge of their their belongings. Right. He wakes up and finds her doing that. Yeah. Okay. And there's a hullabaloo about it. And, and in, this is a terrible thing. You're a thief and da 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 and all this. And Amal says, don't hurt my mother. She didn't mean it. I, I'm sure that she did it for me. And, you know, so one of the kings, uh, by the way, the kings are King Casper, King Melchior, and King Bathasar. And so one of them says, King Malkhar says, you know what, keep the gold. We understand your situation. And so Amal says, uh, well, I'd like to give something to the, to the baby right. as well. How about I just give my crutch? And the mother is astonished. But Amal, you can't walk without that. Right. So when the crutch is handed over, uh -huh. okay, he can suddenly walk. Ah, a miracle. And it's, that's the whole, the, it's a miracle story, yeah, right. of it. And so the Magi um, actually want to touch Amal because it's a sort of a conduit between right. the Christ child and right. this poor boy. And so um, they asked, do you want to come with us? And you can bring the crutch yourself. And that's how it ends. Ah. And it's a... It's beautiful story and beautiful music, beautiful music, and we do it with uh, so when orchestra that, too. And now so that is, when is this that's coming up. Actually, we're doing three performances in three different churches, and that okay. is the way that we're bringing it to the community. Okay. Uh, we're doing a St. Mary's Church in Bordentown on December third. Okay. Uh, at Church of St. Gregory the Great on December ten. Uh, all this coming December. And uh, St. David the King uh, in uh, Princeton Junction okay. on the 16th. Wow. But all of that is on our website, right. uh, boamopera.org. And uh, we're so excited about this because we have a great cast, of course. 
but we are premiering uh, two young uh, singers, okay. and they will share the role of Amal uh, between the three performances. Um, we're so when you on say that young, we, one is a, one is eleven, okay, and one is fourteen, okay, but um, they're shorter, you know, and they're right. um, but. But the voices are already developing, and so uh, my husband is uh, Joseph, and their teachers are coaching them. Right, right. And as we speak, they so are getting ready. This is like a, a, an, an unbelievable opportunity for those two young men. Oh, uh, actually, it's two young girls. Oh, two young okay. girls. We went. We did go through an audition process, and um, it's very interesting. Uh, young girls' voices develop faster and quicker and more. Uh, focused okay. than young boys. Ah, yeah, and so because you see, at the age of uh, 12, 13, the boys' voices are changing. Yes. And this is written for boy soprano. Right. So, uh, but we did okay. we did audition both boys and girls, and, and uh, these are the best. Uh, one uh, actually, they're they're both from Pennsylvania, but uh, it's uh, right over the right over the bridge, but. Um, I'm very, very excited about uh, having them and uh, the rest of the cast. Mm -hmm. uh, we have um, a chorus mm -hmm. the, of Shepherds, which is uh, it's just beautiful, beautiful music. And we have a dancer as well. Uh, she's Russian, actually. So when you, when you bring this to the church, that's mm -hmm. meaning you need to move everybody in the church, move all the decor, well, what we're doing it is, uh, t and two of the three churches were actually staging it on the, um, uh, I, I guess what you would call the altar. Okay. The altar itself. Becomes and the main. Becomes, right. And uh, we had actually done them all one time in 2019 uh, on the altar at Immaculate Conception in Trenton, and it was mm -hmm. a great success. Right, right. So we used that as a sort of a template. Mm -hmm. but all the churches are different right so yes. um, so uh, the last church st. David the King uh, the altar was too um, it was not conducive for right. staging okay. so they have a, a marvelous large community hall right uh, which they use when they're mm -hmm. not doing uh, masses in there all three right. churches are Catholic churches mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and um, we're thrilled all the um, the priests, the authorities there, everyone is very excited. Mm -hmm, yes. And it's going to probably come out very soon as far as uh, each one. They're doing announcements from the pulpit. They're yes. doing all sorts of stuff in their bulletins and, right, right. and the monitor and all sorts of places. Yes. Yeah, That's awesome. Yeah. So watch it on the website. The dates are the 3, 10, and 16. That's correct. That's correct. Mm -hmm. On bohemopera.org. Your Town Tube is today's number one all-local promotion, social media and networking in the Princeton-Mercer region. The most effective, attractive, quickest and affordable ways to reach a huge local audience.